Hello guys, welcome to my channel Splunk in 5 minutes. Today we are going to discuss about some important websites that you should know if you are using Splunk for your development activities. The first and most important site is answers.splunk.com. Actually this is the forum of question and answer where uh, your questions will be answered by the community members. So even you can post your question, uh, see uh, you can ask your questions here on this community uh, forum and it will be answered by the experts around the globe so uh, I think you should have this uh, site in your list uh, while working with Splunk the second important site is uh, uh, usersgroup.splunk.com this is a community site where you can uh, join the groups uh, nearby your locations or regions uh, you can just find the mentor or find some developers who are working on some topic so here you can search your uh, region or country and you will see the all user groups nearby you the third important source is uh, Splunk blogs so these are very beautiful blogs you can see on this site uh, on the latest updates in Splunk world also uh, you can get uh, some tips and tricks related information you can uh, explore the blogs by category also you can see that uh, Splunk in the IoT, Splunk machine learning Splunk security, Splunk tips and tricks so you can uh, read here almost everything about uh, Splunk so you should have this website also in your favorite list another very important site is uh, Splunk Docs where you can explore the document by product wise like Splunk Enterprise, Splunk Cloud, Forwarder etc also you will see uh, various categories where uh, you can explore the documentation about developer tools best practices about the products and some add-on and apps so this is also the best site you can refer while learning the Splunk another interesting platform is a Splunk developer program uh, where you can uh, build uh, solutions for the Splunk enterprise application if you want to work for Splunk enterprise if you want to develop some applications and you want to put in on the splunkbase.com site where you can you know deploy your uh, own applications for the Splunk so uh, for them this is the best site uh, to uh, refer so you can see here if you want to develop for Splunk Enterprise you can just click here and uh, look for the details and, uh, and uh, here is the last and most important website is wiki.splunk.com you can see this is the main page of wiki.splunk.com uh, you can almost find everything, uh, uh, all content, all structured documentation on this page. Also, whatever the link we have seen so far, uh, here are the shortcuts or uh, just uh, side pages you can directly access from these tabs. And uh, uh, you can uh, read more information about uh, every topics uh, under Splunk. And another thing that uh, if you want to uh, sign in or uh, post your questions or you get involved into any discussions uh, you can use the same credential which you had created for uh, downloading the Splunk on Splunk.com website so this is the single credential you can use across all these sites uh, to access the information I hope you found this video useful uh, and these links are very important uh, while working with Splunk I will put uh, the link of all these pages uh, into the description of this video so please refer that links and uh, get start with Splunk and uh, if you found this video useful uh, please do like comment share and subscribe to my channel Splunk in 5 minutes thanks for watching this video